Hello Newcastle United fans, I bring here another news from the Magpies, but I ask you to subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell and stay informed of everything that happens at Newcastle United. So let's get to the video. How confirms three injuries ahead of Tottenham trip and issues Alan St. Maximin update. Starting with Joe Linton, it seems the Brazilian is a doubt for the weekend, with how revealing that the extent of his knee problem remains slightly unclear. The big man was forced off at the break during Wednesday's 1-0 win over Everton and will be assessed over the coming days, although the boss remains, hopeful it's not serious. He's also confirmed that Paul Damet has picked up a calf problem, while Javier Manquillo has been absent with an ankle injury. Alan St. Maximin is making good progress after suffering a fresh setback last week, with how revealing that he's been working very hard with the physios to ensure he's back fit and firing before the World Cup break in three weeks' time. How on Joe Linton? He had a knock to the side of his knee. It was quite an unusual one as we thought it was a knock and hopefully he could run it off. Joe is the type of lad that is very mentally strong and can play with lots of different things in my time here so when he said he had to come off at halftime, we knew there was a potential issue there. We're hopeful it's not serious but at this moment in time it's slightly unclear. Leave your like on this video, this is very important so you don't miss the latest news from Newcastle United that we will publish in the next few hours. Thanks and continuing. How on Damet and Menkio. Paul Damet picked up a calf problem, so he's working his way back to fitness and Menkio picked up an ankle injury, but he will train today. Sometimes injuries take time to come to the fore. We'll see the lads again today. Hopefully there's nothing too serious. How on St. Maximin returning before the World Cup break? We hope so. I haven't seen too much of him over the past few days, but I think he's making good progress on his recovery. He's very focused on his recovery and working very hard with the physios to get his injury right. Leave your opinion in the comments, if you are not subscribed to the channel then subscribe and activate the bell with all notifications for you to receive all the next news from Newcastle United. See you in the next video, see you soon.